Do you guys like making fizzy balloons? Yeah! yeah! A chemical reaction involves mixing two things together and making something new. And there are some spectacular chemical reactions you can do at home. One of our favorites is called fizzy balloons. And all you need for this reaction are an empty water or soda bottle, a balloon, some baking soda, which is also called sodium bicarbonate, and some vinegar, which is also called acetic acid. To do this experiment, simply pour some vinegar into the bottom of your bottle, maybe a third of a cup of vinegar, and then we'll add about a teaspoon or two of baking soda to the So take a spoon. Can you hold this, please? Hold the balloon open and then put a few teaspoons of baking soda right into the balloon. Okay, go ahead, put it in. Add another one. Thank you. When you have the baking soda inside the balloon, carefully put the lip of the balloon over the mouth of the bottle, but don't add your baking soda yet. You want to wait until you're ready for your chemical reaction. When you combine baking soda and vinegar, the chemical reaction produces carbon dioxide gas. Now you can't see carbon dioxide gas, it's invisible, but you can watch it blow up a balloon so you know the reaction's happening. It's a good idea to wear safety goggles or sunglasses during this experiment. None of the ingredients are harmful, but if your balloon explodes off the bottle and you get vinegar in your eyes, it can sting. So, to start your chemical reaction, shake the, hold the mouth of your balloon onto the bottle and go ahead guys, shake the baking soda into the vinegar. Whoa! You can see the bubbles start to form, the chemical reaction's happening, and whoa! You can see the carbon dioxide <laughs> filling up the balloon. Yeah! Yeah? She's got big! <laughs> <laughs> Look, mine like filled. Oh, so what are you waiting it? for? Let's do some chemical reactions.